friends. My name is Dr. Sean Bugelbex. <laughs> and I am Dr. Jack T. Hammond III, Ph.D. And this is our te test subject. I'm Mike. <laughs> so we decided to go look at the Neanderthal genome and how they, they interacted with humans. Uh, after searching all over Pennsylvania... Hum wait, 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 oh, no. Um, it is weird. Uh, Neanderthal? No. no. Squirrel. You, you, uh, That's an not, we're not looking for humans, are we? No. no. Well, we decided to go to their natural habitat in the sovereign nation of Denmark. Unfortunately, the laboratory wouldn't give us transport grants, so, so we had to walk. Well, that was a really long walk that we totally just did, didn't make up. And it's true what they say about Denmark. It smells really different. Yeah, it does. Yeah. <sighs> Uh, wow, that, that was, that was fast. <laughs> yeah, that, that, no, definitely Neanderthals. Neanderthals. De definitely. So, uh, after we, we captured the Neanderthals, we discovered they were good at certain things, such as hunting. <laughs> Using simple tools... Mike, go! Get out of there! <laughs> they didn't bury their dead. <laughs> and they're oh so hairy. This documentary for a short commercial break. Jack Link's Beef Jerky presents Messing with Neanderthal. Dude, there's a Neanderthal. Oh, check this out. Bye bye. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> How could he do this to my car? <laughs> Jack Link's jerky, featured wild sound. Okay, so Joe casts our game brilliance, and it's effective. Uh, would anyone like to make a move? I shall attack him with my magic missile. All right, that's a d20 roll, and it is effective. Okay, so the Pit Fiend uses his Fire Breath on Justin, and it is a critical hit. Uh, Justin, that means you're defeated. <laughs> uh, okay, so I use my plus three mace to attack the Pit Fiend, and it's effective. Dungeons and Dragons, it is effective. We now return to your regularly scheduled programming, still in progress. And then we decided to create the Ultimate Bee. Which uh, consists of, of course, half human and half Neanderthal genes. But as of now, we're not really sure how we're going to do that. Hey guys, what's going on? Mike. Release the human! Uh, what am I doing here, guys? Oh, it's you. <gasps> it's in the name of science, Mike. So six months later, we, uh, we had a great success. Um, half human, half Neanderthal, and it's just, it's just working in, out great in, for us. Impeccable. Impeccable work. We give you doll.0. 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 <coughs> Sorry, anybody else read that uh, Harry Potter story by uh, J.K. Rollins? <coughs> <coughs> oh. Wow. That wall in the garage like Pontiac Sunfire. I'm <laughs> 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 <laughs>